and then through turn 12, right before turn 12, he gets turned around. Now, one lap to go, presented by Credit One Bank, and pulling away is Shane Van Gisbergen. He is pulled away by a second plus, 1.2 seconds over Ty Gibbs. They just cleared one. Here comes the right-hander. That's turn two. Back onto Lakeshore Drive is Shane Van Gisbergen. The best car today has found his way back to the front when it counts, but it's not over yet. Tough section of racetrack here. He'll go through turn number three. No pressure from behind. He continues to leg it out over Ty Gibbs and Kyle Larson in that second spot. SVG through four, out of five, and onto Columbus Drive for the last time. Unless that car breaks, turn out the lights, the party's over. Shane Van Gisbergen is about to win his third consecutive race here in the NASCAR Xfinity Series. For the final time, under braking into six, he'll hang the left-hander onto the short straightaway, over the train tracks, and down the hill into turn seven. Everybody brought their best today to try to take it to Shane, but he is ready for the action. He likes the fight. He enjoys the aggressiveness. No one to get him to get out of him who he is. No one was able to make him make the big enough mistake. This guy is a world-class racer, and he's making everybody in NASCAR better. He was a favorite coming in, and it's very difficult to be able to perform with that much pressure. But I'm guessing that Auckland, New Zealand is his favorite city, but number two on the list has to be Chicago. Shane Van Gisbergen is going to do it again. He wins in Chicago.